going to show you how to charge your Nintendo Switch console as well as the Joy-Cons. doesn't matter if you have the original um, Nintendo Switch or the OLED model. Now the first way to charge it, if you go ahead and grab your um, Switch charging cable, so you go ahead and plug that in on the bottom here, and then we see that this one is currently charging. Now when you have these attached, the Joy-Cons, these are also charging too. So we got the console and the Joy-Cons charging while it is plugged in. Now if you want to see the uh, how much battery juice you have left, I mean on the console you can see up here, 28%. And then if you want to see the Joy-Cons, you got to tap on the controller here. Go to controllers. And then you can see the left Joy-Con charging. The console is the middle one charging. The other side Joy-Con is charging as well. Now the thing is, when I, if I take it off, So now you can see this just popped on here. So I got my left controller here. I see how much battery juice I have. Oh, I'm sorry, it's the right Joy-Con. And I see how much battery juice I have left, but now it's not charging. Okay, so if you go ahead and unhook these and leave this charge, it's only going to be charging the console, not the actual uh, Joy-Cons. Now another way to charge it, you can go ahead and use your docking station. Okay, so let me go ahead and plug in my charging cable into here. So now when I pop this into the docking station right here, now I know that it is charging right now because I see that little green light down here, okay? So the console's charging and also the Joy-Cons are charging. But again, remember, if I go ahead and pull this off, this is not going to be charging. Only this one and this Joy-Con that's connected. Now another way that you can charge the uh, Joy-Cons is, for example, I have this uh, charging dock here where I can go ahead and it's plugged in. I'll go ahead and turn it on right now and I can charge these Joy-Cons. Let me go ahead and attach these on here. And you can see as soon as I plug it in, this one is red because this one is charging. And let me go ahead and add another one on here. Pop that in here. We can see this one is charging as well. Now we can actually hook up two more Joy-Cons on this one here. So just a quick example. There's another one here. I'll pop that in here. You can see that this one is charging as well, okay? Now with this uh, charging station here now, let me just move this one over here. We'll go ahead and charge these two. And now you have, on this side, if you don't put another um, Joy-Con on here, you have another um, out, um, charging, port, charging port right there. So you can go ahead and charge your Pro Controller on here as well. And as soon as I pop the switch in or the um, the Pro Controller, I can see that it's charging because there's a red light down here. Now in regards to the uh, Joy-Con, there's other uh, very similar stations where you can go ahead and charge to. Like this is the grip here. This isn't the original grip. Okay, This is the original grip. You can't charge it. There's no charging port. This one here has a charging point port. So you're able to um, pop, slide your uh, Joy-Cons in here and have it charging as you're playing as well. And I'll give you another example. Here's another one I have. Basically, it's this one here. The only thing is it doesn't have the uh, charging port down here to charge your uh, Pro Controller, but you can charge four um, Joy-Cons. Anyway, I'll put links down where you can get all of these. Hopefully, this video helped you out. If you have any questions or issues, just comment below. All right.